Digital dreams. I am so overlit by this. All right, last time we played Metrico, uh, we, let's see, should I go here? Should I go here? Uh, we got through several levels. I'm not sure how deep into the game we are exactly. Uh, we were about to start a brand new level with a brand new ability. And I'm not even sure I remember what my old abilities were. Hey there, X Rogan. I think at some point Ian may be joining us. Oh yeah, that's right, I got a robot leg now. So I can jump, I can shoot. I can make checkpoints. Whoa, whoa, what? Well, that is interesting. So it seems like you probably wanted to be on that tall one. Why? Oh, why starts the entire section over? Okay. Alright, so interesting that like checkpoint reloads are like the fourth ability I've unlocked. Usually you think of that as being fundamental to a game. Hello, Dunedain. Yes, we are platforming with spreadsheets, uh, with uh, infographics. So as I move to the right, that one goes up. But shooting. Boink. 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 So the further I. It's just, oh, movement in general raises that one on the right. And that one gets lowered by activating checkpoints. I'm not sure I fully understood that one, but I'm down here, so. Oh, I, uh, oh, oh, ah! No! Squish! Alright. Oh, but I can't get through. So do I need to... Okay, so you need to jump just enough. Okay, but that doesn't work. Nope. I like squishing myself. Okay, so if I hit Y, that wipes. Thing. I want to get up there, I'm betting. How do I... Is there a, oh yeah, of course there's a way to get up there. If I can just get on top of that thing. Hmm. Oh wait, of course, of course. I know exactly what I'm doing now. Alright, here's what we're going to do. going to... That thing, well, okay. I don't know exactly what I'm doing. I know most of what I'm doing. There we go. Might not even need that, let's see. So if I just get, as long as I get on top of that and I just start jumping. Jump, de 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 jump. Activate that. Then, boink. There we go. I am through. Ah! 
What is going on? Okay. Okay. I have to shoot that thing then before I get there. So at some point, probably near the end of the stream, uh, I'm going to choose a random person to receive a um, a code for Metrico. So as you're watching me play this game, think about whether uh, whether you're interested in having one. Okay, so that's not helping me at all. What did I do that... I think it's triggering them that... And then dying brings that down. Okay, we gotta wipe and try again. So activating doesn't... Wait, what moves the purple one? Activating this one does. Oh, but reloading it makes it retract. Gonna jump back and forth. Do that without dying. Hey there, Epic Sakura! Alright, so this one moves forward with me. Oh no, I. Ah! Okay. Uh, and that was bad. Okay, we gotta wipe and figure this out. Alright, so that will produce two things. Oh, does it spawn one each time I... No? What makes it... What made it spawn last time? Reloading did it. Okay. Which raises that one, which I can't use. Moving to the right, moving to the left. So doing that loses me ground. So I'm gonna run over here really fast. So I can't rechart. I can't restart from that one. Okay. So I think what I need to do is make this really quick. Ah. Okay. So I can't do that. And I can't fall off that side. All right. Mm. So 
So if I let myself respawn from the ring on the right, I'll have to either pull it all the way to the left, which blocks me off, or I need to... Yes. If this thing didn't extend so far... Like if I had to... Yeah, because basically I always have to run off the end of this one. Unless I come up with something very clever. Yeah, I just don't think there's enough time for me to clear this before at least one of them goes off the cliff. Okay. Yeah, and the only way for me to not get killed... Okay. Hmm. Hey there, Tur uh, hey there, Turvama. So I'm trying... So they've given me the level wipe ability. So moving left does not help me because that just advances that further. Of course, oh, I think I know what I can do. Okay, so if I run this first and immediately grab that, spawn from it twice and then run left then I should have time. To do that. All right, got it. We got it. Woohoo! All right, we got a little dude. Got a switch. Beefs up that thing. But each time we do that, this happens. Oh, and something made them spawn. Okay, so I can raise that again. All right, let's try this again. So if I can shoot them, While I'm on the, hmm, okay, what happens to get the scene? So hitting that raises this and lowers that. All right, and then oh, whoops. That goes over their heads, okay. Okay, I think I actually need to, to spawn them a little closer together. Close the edge and then that's as far as this goes. Okay, I guess I need to limit how low I drop it originally. Okay. So I actually have to drop it as little as possible. Oh, that was a bad move. Hey there, Ian. Hey there, Jeffrey. You got a particularly tough one here. So I'm trying. There's a lot more color in the game at this point. Yeah, it's it's like slowly filling out, right? Yeah. Okay, so we've got these two enemies, and I need to get this left-hand thing 
up high enough that it'll be useful to me when I'm falling down from above. But I can't get let that right one get too low. So I need... What makes the one on the right? Go. So it goes... So basically, each time I hit that... Uh, platform, the one on the left goes up, one on the right goes down. But, the one on the right will go back up if I kill monsters. So I think if I just murder these monsters right now... Well, you don't even have to kill them, you just have to shoot them. Yeah. And then, if I got everything right, I should be able to make that jump. Cross there. So, the new power that I just unlocked is screen wipe which basically just returns me to the beginning of the current setup. So they're doing lots of puzzles where the exactly when and how you checkpoint is important and you can screw yourself up. And so they've given you level wipe so okay. that you can uh, try again. So, all right, so jumping, moving, doesn't do much. Stepping on those things doesn't seem to do anything. You've got... Okay, so, so firing brings that thing down. And I'm trapped. Okay, things I have not tried yet include falling to my death. Oh, yeah, that's one of the things. Uh, uh, getting murdered. Yeah. Getting murdered. But I think you only want to get murdered once. I think maybe so. But what other things can I do? The shooting him does not help. Shooting brings down that barrier. Getting squished. Oh. Yes. I still have no idea what the last one is going to be. Uh, yeah. Maybe is it, squishing that guy. Oh, no, it's just consciously respawning. Oh, so, so do that. Probably okay, that. so I think I, think I need to wipe now. Okay, so. Four of those. Squish, 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 squish. Okay. Uh, let's fall in a hole. Let's fall in another hole. Let's fall in another hole. Let's jump and murdered. Okay. Now let's not get murdered again. Is this it? There we go. We did it. Woohoo! Hey there, so Turvomot, Misk, uh, in case you missed it, we are going to be giving away a free copy of Metrico that we got very nicely from the publisher of Metrico. Um, yeah. We'll be doing That's that towards nice. the end of the stream, I guess. So if you stick around, uh, you might get that. Oh, so there's that actually moves the, the respawn point as well. Yeah, so we can pump this thing up, and that thing is constantly moving. So what else happens? So this thing is just always staying a little bit above me, but if I fall, oh, okay, okay. I, so I've got to hit that checkpoint and then pump it up. Oh, crap. But I think lift it a little bit first. I think I might be able to. Okay, you just hit it from there. there. Yeah, so I can pump it up. Pump, pump, pump. Pumping up, pumping it up. And then, if I go to it... Then that works somehow? Okay. Yeah, okay. Why not? X equals 45, 46, 47, 52. Running. No, oh. Okay, not that. So most of this was just kind of on autopilot. Uh, drop down. I don't... Can I drop down? I don't think I can. So that just happens over time, so, maybe. So maybe I need to more confidently... Jump down onto the, the percentage thing. I don't... Oh, I can? Yeah, I don't, the X only proceeds forward. And that, now what I'm doing... What am I... Why did I do that? Well, I was hoping... The other thing is measuring your Y. Oh. Oh, is that, oh, is that a Y? I read that as a 4, and I was yeah, confused. Yeah, no, that's a Y. That 100% thing, I don't know what the deal is with that. Oh, strange. Is that just is the hundred percent thing just happening from time? Yeah, I think it is. I, I wonder if, like, so, if I just run continuously, can I beat it? You can, but you didn't get that Y down. So okay. So how do I? 
I don't know. If they, I don't know if that's helping. Um, okay, yeah. So that hundred percent. Jump thing. off now. Just see what happens. Okay, so I wonder. Maybe I need to clear this blue thing, but get on. Oh, almost. Oh, that thing goes up when you jump up. So you need to get to the Y, jump on it a bunch of times to get it up out of your way. No? Why? What's your deal? Maybe I need to get on the blue thing earlier. To raise the Y thing higher? And stop that. And then... But no, but that doesn't work. <laughs> yeah, no, you can't make that thing progress. Okay, so... so you've gotten the Y to go up a little bit. What is the Y? So the, I don't understand what the Y's deal yeah, is. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what it's doing either. Because you, you made it go up once. Yeah. Like, by doing this, I think. No? No, it's I up. that worked last time. Oh, That's, yeah, it is higher. It is higher. It's higher. So I, really what's missing here is understanding the functionality of the Y. So I think it's limited. It can go up to Y equals 218 and that's it. Or whatever you're doing to get it to go up is, is enough. Maybe the Y, like, jumping to the right is what makes the Y go up? Oh, maybe so. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that is what it is. You're correct. Jumping to the right. N oh. oh, you jerks. Was that one time-based? I guess. Okay, so. I didn't move that enough. I think that was enough. So I just gotta now I just gotta dash for it. Dash for it, dash for it, dash for it. Yeah. Whew. I do not feel like I really understood what happened there. But as long as we can get through, I guess it's fine. Yeah. Oh no, more headaches. I wonder what part of it will be a robot next. Oh, Lord Fortuna says that Y only goes up when you jump from X. That seemed from the X platform. That seems like that might make sense. That would make sense. All right, so anyway, we had a headache. Let's keep going. Man, this is just like real life. You just, you know, you sometimes you just have a headache and you gotta keep going. going. Uh, Epic Sakura says they're rather impressed now considering how many times uh, they probably would have rage quit by this point. <laughs> oh no, oh no, I'm being, I'm being chased by the thing and the, oh, oh, hello? Uh. Oh, then. No. We'll try jumping from while well, there. Just stand there and jump. See if you can bring it around. Oh, yeah! Hey there. Alright. So now what? Probably needed to. Uh, that dude down on the ground. Oh, uh, maybe so. Or maybe, maybe just like shoot I did one once. of three. And this is zero of three, so this could probably go up two. I just need to figure out how. And I want to know what the difference is between these. Okay, so I'm betting that that one of three is me activating these. So I'm going to do that twice. See what happens. Try shooting the monster. So that okay, so oh, that no. lowers that. Maybe try getting hit by the monster. It's just yeah. I'll try. Let me just see if that did anything. 
Okay, so I did nothing. What happens if I am murdered? I just restart. So what did I, I think do? It might be time to wipe. Because hitting the monster made the game sad. Oh, everything's way up there now. What? So things at th they're both at three of three now. Activated the one on the right. That brought one of them down. That brought that one down. So um, activate the one on the right again. Okay, that... So activating checkpoints drops that one. Okay. So, activating so restart. Any... Act, just activate each of them once. Now go check. All right, that's where we want that one. Wait, did I want to shoot? Oh! Just and the one time, though. Shooting it the one time brought that down. Then I think you might want to get hit by him. And then you can just hop your way back to... Does reloading a checkpoint affect any of them? I'm not sure, but I don't think dying ever did, so just die. And now hop your way to joy. All right. Here we go. Hey, uh, yeah, so to miss, the background doesn't actually affect the gameplay at all. It is just sort of window dressing, but it kind of reinforces a sense that, you know, you're in this, like, modern info infographic. They've just got all the kinds of weird things you see they in also, modern infographics. Um, background effects tend, tend, I don't know if I can say this is 100% the case, but so far I've only noticed them uh, reacting when you do something that causes something to happen. Oh, that's true. Like, jumping to the right, if that doesn't actually move something in the level, it won't move something in the background. Okay, so I'm doing a bad thing here. Okay, so reloading lowers that. Okay, I, need, I think I need to wipe. All right, so... Reloading. Ow! Why did... Why did both of them... What do I do that makes them both spawn? Um, jumping makes them spawn. I... I think it might just... I, I don't think Is it's it jumping. jumping or dropping? Because I think it might be dropping, but... It, oh, maybe it's landing. It's landing. Okay, landing makes them spawn. We want to raise the second one, the dark blue one, but the light blue one, we want to barely raise at all, probably. Okay. What raises that? So, oh, it looks like maybe shooting raises the light one, but killing raises the dark one? Try shooting up here to see what happens. Oh, missing lowers this one. Which is, a, that's a, you don't really want to miss it and drop it much lower. Dang it. It's, it takes time for you to be able to shoot again. So yeah, if I shoot, that raises that one. So that doesn't give me Unless much to work with there. Unless there's a way to drop there. that first one. Or a way to kill these guys that doesn't involve shooting them. Yeah, that's the thing. I've never heard of killing them without shooting them. So, wait, what did we learn? Was the, Oh, yeah, it was missing that brings down that other one, right? Yeah. Huh. Of course, actually, if I... Okay, I'm, I can land on this a little bit, but if it's a little bit higher, I would miss it. I was trying to think maybe I can just jump, make that jump. But that doesn't seem to be the case. 
So yeah, killing these guys. Trying to see if there's any other movement or anything that will bring the lighter blue one down. So Xorgan is saying the left one is too low, which okay. I don't think there's a way bring up the first one without respawning at least once. Oh, no! Okay. Here's a theory. If we... If we kill one, but don't actually respawn, but we let this one murder us? Oh. Drop down and get killed. See if you try and make that jump again. Uh, oh. Not quite. So I guess we have to do that. And then we can't make that. Uh. But almost. Yeah, we're so we're so close, but is it Oh oh wait! What? Miss a shot? And now you're too low. Oh, but I... Did I get close enough that if I wipe? Nope. <laughs> I thought maybe I got close enough that if I wiped, it would count me as being in the next area, which could be hilarious. Okay. So I think you're on the right track. That You have to get both of those meters all the way up. Yeah, so you need to murder both of these little dudes. Man, I really wish that my shooting was more responsive after a landing. And then respawn. And then I think you can jump to 4-4 four, four there. Okay, no, I think I still need to only kill one. But then the blue won't be high enough. Mm -hmm. I mean, unless it's supposed to be there. Maybe, maybe that's... Because you can make that jump. Well, no. I can't make this one. Well, and and more importantly, you can't get the second, the dark blue, to 2-2. Two, two. Unless I've done the 4-4. Four, four. Unless you've done the 4-4. Four, four. We got so close last time. I felt. Just missing this by inches. All right, so I can't make that, so I do this. I think. And then I don't need. And then if you miss a shot, you're not quite high enough. I wonder if there's a way to kill that thing while I'm standing here. Well, so you don't need the high, the thing to be high. Well, I need, yeah, so I, The three-fourths thing. Because you can jump up on the two-fourths. Yeah, that's true. So, can't you aim your gun? Oh, I can. I can aim it. So the question is, could I not even spawn that guy? Okay. No, no, okay. I, I, yeah. I, I think I have it. Okay. Wipe. Uh, bring the four four all the way down. Jump far enough that you land over here. 
Okay, one spawns. Shoot him down in the hole. Like a dog. Okay. Now... See, the thing I'm thinking is that you have to do your next land from there and try and shoot him when he first spawns. Yeah, so I think it needs to be... Yep. Woohoo! Nice. There was. What? This game makes you do ridiculous things. Like after you su succeeded a puzzle, you just feel like, what? Oh, what, what, what? is here. What's up, man? Hey, Cerebral Mises. Oh. So jumping uh, brings to miss, that one Yes, down. this is indeed Brian. Okay, well that didn't work. Um, okay, so each time I jump, that one comes down a little bit, and each time I land, the other one comes down. Oh no, no, it's falling! Okay, so I need to fall the exact right am Oh wait. So I need to fall... So is the idea that I need to fall that much? So I think one this got to be the reason for the wipe, right? Yeah. The one on the right goes up when you land, right? Oh, yeah, so i got to avoid landing too much. Yeah, so you want to jump out, miss that first ledge, or now drop down just to the first ledge. So I think that's part of it, is, is managing that... It's, is this ledge here, that short ledge right next to the respawn, is yeah. that there because you need it, or is that there to fuck you? That's the question we have. Yeah. Right. <laughs> okay, so I think I think I did an unnecessary jump there. Let's let's try it, like with me not jumping, like I've got some kind of problem. Um, jumping is really fun. So you're gonna jump onto that platform. And then... And land. And that's going to make that thing shoot up. And yeah, you're going to need to wipe. Okay, so another option is maybe doing some measured jumps like this that don't put me all the way down. That still raises the second one really high. Yeah, I wonder, like, can I clear it? Oh, but then... It, yeah, no, and I definitely cannot get to anywhere useful there by jumping. Like, I, I, that pink one has to be at an appropriate jumping level. Maybe drop down once. It's a little ledge. Oh, not, not like that? No, not like that. I'm just like, let's try what options we have. So, white. Drop down to the little ledge once now drop all the way now you're gonna and that one's still at four percent here yeah which would force me to jump against yeah so so wipe just to see what happens not because step I think down this first is just like step down once ooh ooh <laughs> uh -huh. you can uh, pop back to the respawn location while well, mid fall right Oh, yeah, probably. You just have to do it before you touch the ground so that the second one doesn't go. <laughs> uh, yup. Oh, oh no, you can't do it in midfall, can you? You can. I can. Okay. So, yeah. Let's wipe again. Because if it's one fall, you'll get it. Oh, that was not the B button. Hold on. <laughs> You are weirdly on the line between the cameras right now, by the way. Oh, I'm, yes, you I am. Some kind of mute. So we, you can get closer to me or further All from right. me. I'm good. Either works here. I'll, I'll get a little closer to you so it doesn't look like I'm avoiding you. Um, so, B button. And B button. And B button. And... You just fall this time. Boink. No jump on top of it, and you're out. Yes. Are we at the end? Is this the end? 
think so. Of the level, anyway? I don't know how many levels there are in this game. I have no clue. But I am really enjoying the puzzles. Yeah. They really are an exercise the mechanics. Yeah, you feel yeah, you feel like you almost feel like you're cheating or exploiting. Like, you know, it's like they they make you do things that that feel like in another game they would be breaking the game. Right. I would, I wonder if it matters which door I go in. I don't think it does. Hello. I don't know. Illusion of choice is often just as good as choice in a video game. <laughs> oh no. Are they going to robot me more? My head! I'm going to have a robot head! Eh, that's yeah. fine. Let's yeah. just go in and get our robot head. Maybe now you won't get headaches all the time. Well, that's a good point. Here we go. If I had a robot head, and I got headaches all the time, <laughs> I would be pissed. <laughs> uh, what is happening? They're replacing your head, man. Oh, yeah, that probably hurts. Uh, now you got a cool robot head. Whoosh. You get vacuumed up. And now we're playing Mini Metro again. Going this way. How are we doing on time? 12.42. Given how long that last one took, I don't think we're making it all the way through this one. We're gonna, we're gonna do what we can though. We're gonna find out how this, uh, how this <laughs> new mechanic works. Lord Fry 2 said, robot head, it's Headlander all over again. <laughs> Weren't you a clone head, or were you a robot? That I was a clone. Movie? No, I was a clone head on a rob on robot bodies. Yeah. So it's totally different. This is a robot head on a mostly human body. So X doesn't do anything. Oh. Okay. Terrible idea, making me hold. The I mean, to you guys, it looks like the right. Uh, Oh wow, okay, so. You can pull shots back to yourself? If I hold it down, it'll bounce. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, this is a very shiny place. Accomplished. I don't think it was good. Right, let's try this again. I've got to do four of four somethings to make this thing move. So let's try. That just sounds like failure. So what happens if I go the? Ah! Whoa! Okay, that murders me. Nice to know. Resets aren't doing anything. Nothing I can tell. Also wipes. So I wonder, okay, what happens if I... I think it goes away forever, okay. Oh, but I can... Oh, the other one was... Oh, so it was counting down when you killed the first guy. Oh, I just couldn't see it because I was up high. All right. Uh, now, now, now we're playing Headlander right now. Yeah, wow. <laughs> and it's on the robot head one. That's really striking. <laughs> Hello? Whoa, we've never been up here before. Wait, 
Why did that just move close to me? That was weird. Uh, the X value of your shot is zero? Seems to be what it's indicating. Try bouncing off the area above you to, down to the ground. Down to the... Let's, uh, wipe, rewipe. Because it cares about where you're aiming. Oh, yeah, if I aim left, it'll go over there. I think, do you want to kill those guys? Maybe? I think you gotta, yeah, kill him first, because killing him will make the thing unable to point at him. Oh. So if this guy... Yeah, that should be far enough. And if it's not, I can probably hit that guy from here. Oh, yeah. Nope. It's a lot like Hitler. Where you missed the guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Burn! Oh! All right. So aiming to the right ever moves that raises thing. that thing. So you just have to walk over to the right, turn around, and then shoot everybody by banking shots. Okay, I might have to not hit that second one. Or do it once you've already stepped up on a platform. So you now, see, now you can jump to the right. Oh! A different angle you can hit him from. Perfect. Yeah. And I had to fire before the first bullet hit. So that I could, yeah, hit it before it came down again. Alright. Aiming both ways, nothing. Shooting? Just firing raises that one. Well, firing to the right does. You might want to check directions again. What about bouncing? Okay, bounces lower this one. Nothing seems to affect that first one yet. Nothing yet. Maybe it cares what I bounce it off? it off the ground. You can't. Uh, shoot one straight forward and jump over it. Oh, yeah. That would be great. Nobody cares about that. Okay, so I think I need to... I might need to fire one that bounces a bunch of times. I think that's the goal, yeah. For the middle thing. I still have no idea what the, what the other one is, though. Yeah. So I think you need to try and like get something to bounce down into there. Which I don't know how to do that. I don't have anything above me to hit. Does resetting do anything for that first one? Um. Wiping does that. What's B button do? Makes pretty squares. How did it drop? What happened? Me absorbing the shots. Okay. I wish I could reflect the shots. Yeah, so I feel like I need to shoot only twice, but have it bounce six times <laughs> or something like that. 
and have it absorbed by me multiple times, at least twice. So each shot needs to bounce multiple times and hit me. That seems to be the takeaway here. Ooh, just get in tight on the wall. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I can make that happen. That's what I need. I just need the thing to actually hit me in the end. So, maybe if I shoot it really shallowly, I can jump up and get it. <laughs> yes! Very nice. what I want. Oh, it just gives you a safe spot. Oh, I have to hit the target. I think you just have to fire and let the thing bounce around until it gets to that target. My first one got pretty far. Seems like the kind of thing with tricky timing. Hmm. Seems like firing straight is not helping. Maybe uh, walk in and then you can fire from jumping up. I don't think I can fire from midair. Oh, I can. Never mind. Oh, it only took one hit. Nice. I think you had already hit him with one of them. Oh, had I? Okay. I think so, yeah. <laughs> Still bouncing around in there. Okay. So... Jumps, raise this. They also raise the thing on the other side. Oh, okay, and then shots. Shots, 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 shots. I don't know why I would want to do that necessarily. What is that x equals zero thing? Yeah, I don't know. Doesn't seem to be related to the direction that I aim. It doesn't seem to have anything to do with this weird thing I'm doing now. Well, it doesn't even seem like you need it if you could get from one end to the other with fewer jumps. Oh, right. So if I, if I don't need to jump... Okay, so I wouldn't have needed to jump in the middle if I could have hit. Wait. Oh so my gosh. To bank it. Yeah, so so you got how that that was working, right? Like Yeah, that it was uh Every restart. That didn't work well. Oh, come on! I think this one's got him. Now shoot the guy in front of you. So now she should be only one jump. Yeah. To clear this. Yep. There we go. Alright, what time is it? 12.55. Okay, oh, well, we can, we can... Oh, we're gonna fail. It's fine. Failure is... Oh! Death. Death is fine. So I can make it onto this. Each time I jump, it lowers that. So 
each time I just shoot that thing, it moves? Yeah. Okay, so I think I needed to um, do this first. Okay, so I'm bouncing too much. Or, or, is it possible from here to hit the far away guy? Uh, if I bring him down? Oh, nope, that was not what I meant. Here, let's. Maybe down off that eye, up off that eye. Try. So it was like around there. Oh no, wait, no, I needed to jump him down first. First jump him down. But no! Okay, it's only bounces that count though. I can let go if I make a mistake. I have to hold this steady though. There you go. You got him out though. So now you just have to kill the other two guys. And they don't they don't have weird dynamic stuff going on. It makes them hard to kill. And now I will miss the jump! I did not miss the jump. You didn't miss the jump, you did it, Jeffrey. <laughs> so proud. Oh! Oh my robot head! Oh, my robot head is creepy. It's it's a little bit too small. Yeah, pretty upsetting. Where am I? Where, where did I go? Oh. So jump. Okay. So, so one jump just does that. All right. If I... Okay, well, let's obviously... Oh, what? <laughs> So my initial... Okay, so I think it's time in the air that makes that thing fall, because I bet if you tr go ahead and drop down the middle thing, yeah. We've got to figure out shots for the guy. Shots, shots. Shots, shots, shots. Shots, shots. We're, of course, singing about Andy Schatz, creator of Monaco. <laughs> yes. All right, so... so this guy. Yeah. So that will shoot straight down. Go up a little bit. Alright, you got it. Well, let's see. We can't, we can't I do it again? Hmm. Walk forward a little bit. You'll have a slight move. This seems pretty deliberate. Yeah, it does. What about this thing? That's a weird. Yeah, what? Five degree. Oh no! So what raises the middle one? We don't know yet. What if you're a little bit off the floor? You mean like, oh. Yeah, like that. Like that's an interesting angle to try and bank. Well, that's gonna hit the ground, and then we will be out of play. Oh, you're just trying to hit that one dude down there. Nah, yeah, just seeing, yeah, I think it does it still. Oh wait, I know, I know what we need. This is what we need to do. Okay, so I can't let go. All right. So you can't do the thing we normally have to do where you've got multiple shots queued up. 
Except, well, as long as... As long as I know it's gonna hit... I could launch another shot as soon as it's on its last... You on know. its last bit of arc. Oh, no. Okay. Maybe this is not what they intend. Um, certainly keeping my hand here is really hard. Yeah, no, if, once it does that bounce, I think they've timed this out perfectly. So once it does that last bounce, it's too late for me to get another so shot off. what's going on with that middle guy. Have you gotten killed by one of them yet? Uh, oh, no. It's got the, the standing on me thing. Well, I don't know. I don't think that's a standing on me thing. I think that's a, that dotted line is something else. Shoot from, shoot while you're standing there. that dotted line. I've seen them all over the place. I don't have a solid idea of what they mean. Is there a way for me to fall slightly less? Oh, hey, you know what? We're out of time, yeah. and we were gonna give away a free copy of this game. So, um, what, 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 we, what, we, what should we do? Should we have people just say, I want one, and, uh, then we'll, <laughs> and then we'll randomly, generate. let's do this, okay. If you want a copy of this game that you've been watching us play, Metrico, uh, just say, I want one, in the chat. And then uh, we will generate a random number. And uh, in the meantime, while you guys are doing that, I'm gonna quit because we have to get out of here. Quit. Quit, 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 quit. Quit, quit, quit. Where is my quitting? Here's more quitting. There went all the quitting. I quit so hard. I know, man. So Turbama wants one. Look, there's Ian. Hey, everybody. There's me. What am I trying to do? There. Oh, there's both of us right there. Um, okay, so oh, you, as usual, crash on quit. Okay, Trivoma wants one. Tamisk wants one. Anybody else want one? We're going we're gonna to count down here to, I don't know, maybe should we give them like 15 more seconds? Anybody who wasn't quite paying attention? So, here, I'm, 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 okay. We got 10 fingers up. They're all going to go down one at a time. One. Okay, that's it, Turvama and Tamisk. So uh, this is like basically, a, Ian's already got one. So this is basically a uh, coin flip. It's true. Between you guys. So uh, let's see here, Ran I'm at random.org, min one, max two. So one is gonna be Turvama, and two is gonna be Tamisk. And we get Tamisk. So Tamisk. Uh, you see right, right, right over, over there, right there. See my, 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 my Twitter, my Twitter handle right there. Um, send me a private message, and if I'm not following you yet, tweet at me and get me to follow you so that you can send me a private message. Uh, send me a private message on Twitter, and I, and just say, hey, it's Tamisk, and uh, I will give you my code. So that's how that works. Yay, Tamisk! And uh, thank you all for watching. And that is a really cool game. And we've had a lot of fun. So, and thanks for being here, Ian. Yeah, thanks for having me. So, uh, let's see here. Tomorrow. Tomorrow.